The challenge is not an easy one. How do you make the world's most advanced fighter engine, Pratt & Whitney's F-135, even better? Engineer Dr. Steven Bird is part of a team doing just that. The uh, 135 engine is an outstanding engine. Now, Pratt & Whitney is looking ahead to the future needs of all F-35 warfighters. With follow-on modernization upgrades planned for the F-35 weapon system, an F-135 propulsion upgrade can help ensure the F-35 continues to go above and beyond any potential threat. But as you look to the future and the requirements, uh, this uh, product line is looking for more capability in terms of range and thus fuel burn and also thrust. Pratt & Whitney recently completed performance testing on its fuel burn reduction demonstrator engine at its test facility in West Palm Beach, Florida. This development engine leverages a suite of compressor and turbine technologies developed through the Navy-sponsored F-135 fuel burn reduction and Air Force-sponsored component and engine structural assessment research or CSER technology maturation programs. The results? Everything's looking really good. A growth option configuration for the F-135 engine that can provide a 5 to 6 percent fuel burn improvement and a 6 to 10 percent thrust increase across the F-35 flight envelope. It can also enable a 5 percent powered lift thrust increase for the F-35B variant with modifications to the lift fan. So the main thrust here is uh, improving the mission weighted fuel burn of this engine. Uh, we put in a package of advanced aerodynamics in both the compressor and turbine, uh, shooting for a 5% reduction uh, in fuel burn, and we've pretty much achieved that goal. The configuration is called the Growth Option 1.0, a variant common upgrade package for the F-135 engine that limits hardware changes to just the power module, which consists of the compressor, combustor, and turbine. With only the power module affected, this means Growth Option 1.0 can be seamlessly integrated into the global fleet of F-35s, either retrofitted during routine overhauls or cut into production at no impact to the delivery schedule. The upgrade is also fully compatible with existing F-135 sustainment infrastructure. The swap out of power module is really straightforward. That's usually, um, you know, high level maintenance. Uh, it's not a, not a big deal. Um, it's pretty easy to do at any point. It's insertable into any of the variants. You can put it in any time and it basically will give you a step change in, you know, fuel burn decrease and increase in performance. The bottom line? Growth Option 1.0 for the F-135 engine provides a low-cost, low-risk path forward that can bring increased capability into the hands of all participants in the F-35 program by the early 2020s. The proposed upgrade also represents a prime example of Pratt & Whitney's spiral approach to next-generation adaptive technologies, enabling the insertion of these advanced technologies into current and future fighter engine platforms. As we look to the future, um, the next generation of uh, air superiority is looking for engines that have adaptive capability and many of the capabilities that uh, we are demonstrated here.